Anyways, I have, like I said, a word game coming up here. You're, you're welcome, Ronnie. That's why we're here to help one another. Right on. Yeah. If you know something somebody else doesn't know, that's good. Knowledge. I'm going to put up a word here. You guys uh, get your fingers ready and type in the word that you see there as fast as you can. That's the whole idea. And Oh, yeah, I my pencil and paper. So I can write down, and these are only six-lettered words, so they're very, very fast, uh, easy. They, sometimes the answer just pops right out at you. So anyway, here we go. So you see, there you go. Real simple one. Word just pops right out at you. You can figure that one out in no time. But we have an answer here. Sandra. Sandra got the first one. It's people. Um, once you figure out what it is. Here we go. These are all easy because they're only um, six-lettered words. Anyway, Sandra got the second one. You see that? That's easy. They pop right out at you. Here we go. Let's try another word. You guys got to get on and get your fingers going. Here we go. This one might have two, two uh, possible words, but I guess we'll take either one. It's got to have six letters. They're all six-lettered words, by the way. Look at that. Justin and Christina. Some of them I found have more than one answer, um, some not. But anyway, there's 30 of them, so let's get into another one here right away. Here we go. And like I said, some of them pop right out at you, and some of them take a little bit of um, a little bit of time to figure out what the heck they are. It all depends on the lag of the internet, your system. Um, I don't know if lag is concerned with my system. It's it's all put out at the same, put out at the same. It all depends on how fast you get it. Okay, we have an answer, Justin and Christina. Okay, thirty. Thirty is the word. Okay. Hopefully you can see the whole, all the letters this time. Here we go. There we go. This one might not be too easy. It all depends, on, I guess, on your perception of what you can see and what you don't see. The Eaton's Company. <laughs> hey, we have, a, we have another Justin and Christina again. The word donate. right on okay guys get ready here it comes oh yeah okay so this one is correct on my book it's the next one after that that's going to be kind of tricky All right. There's only one, both of you got it, and I guess Sandra came in first this time. Click on that little gear icon and set your speed to twice as fast or something. Maybe that'll help. <laughs> Future. Future is correct. Okay, let's try the next word. Now I got this one future written down again, so that's that's wrong. We'll see what it is. Here we go. Ah, there is no I must have just wrote it down twice. Now this one's got to be simple. 
three A's. Not many words have three A's in them. Um, Sandra got the ban banana. Maybe it, maybe the gear doesn't work when you're using a, um, a phone or a tablet or something. It does work on the computer anyways. I, I never use my phone or my tablet for internet, so that, that's why I don't understand what's going on there. You're connecting connect, eh? Okay, ban Anna. A ban 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 Nana. <laughs> okay, the next word. Homie den. Next word. Oh, wow, that is, you're fast there. The, I look down to do some work. Justin and Christine got the Monday. Monday, Monday. I'm keeping track of who's got what here, so. I see a playback speed. Yeah, right, that's the one. And Justin and Christina had that typed in so fast, I didn't even see it. Come on. Okay, let's try another one. Let's get another one going here. <clears throat> another easy one. <laughs> you, you made, made a misspelling the first time and then you recorrected yourself or you corrected yourself before anyone else typed the word in. Justin and Christine got the nature. Okay, here comes another one with a triple, triple letters. And that should be easy. Just pop right out at you. See that? This is a really easy one. Holy smokes, you must have a fast computer, a fast phone, whatever you're using there. You both got it within seconds of each other, second of each other, but Justin and Christina just pulled in first place really quickly there. Eleven. Eleven is the word. Okay. Here we go. Get those fingers ready. It's funny how sometimes it just, you see it right away and other times you have to think about it. Mailman. <laughs> Mailman's got seven letters. Uh, anyway. <laughs> Uh, looks like Sandra came in first this time. Animal, animal. Now you're getting pretty close to neck and connect. <laughs> That's a good one. Male man. How come it's not male woman? Okay, let's try another word. Here we go. This one should be another simple one. Well, to some people, simple. To others, maybe not so. But okay, how come I can't see what's going on? Okay, Justin and Christina got it first. Friday. It's sun Sunday.
Yeah, I wrote the word Friday instead of Justin and Christina. <laughs> Friday. All right. Okay, this one will just pop right out at you again. Here we go. Another very, very easy one. Oh, I'm not getting any answers from my friends. Wow, you have a you have a fast setup there, Justin and Christina. You came in first again. Yellow, the old yeller. Now this next one, I think, it might have a couple of words. But, okay, I'll have to go by the one that gets the right word. There we go. Six letters. Six letters only. Not seven. What do you think this word is? This one might not jump right out at you. Sandra, snitch. That was a tough one. Snitch. And chins. Not quite chins. Needed a T there somewhere. And chins is what? Five letters. Good try, though. <laughs> okay, the next one is, well, I don't know. This could pop right out at you again. May not. Here we go. Now, this one didn't pop right out at me. I had to think about this one. Thins, thins. Father, Heavenly Father, Sandra, got that one. I think, Sandra, you might be pulling your head. I'll have to do a count at the end. Anyway, give it a try. Uh, okay, we have uh, Justin and Christina said uh, pottery. I don't know. Is that how you spell pottery? I'm not quite too sure. The actual word is poetry, and Sandra got that one first. See, that's uh, I think a lot of people thought uh, pottery, but pottery, I think, P-O-T-E-R. But then that's still the correct word uh, letters, or how is pottery? Pottery, pottery. Hmm, I'm not quite too sure. Anyway, poetry is the word. And Sandra happened to come up with that one first. Beautiful game. Simple. Um, yeah, good game, both of you. You did great. Fantastic. Love the uh, mistake, mistaken ones. But love those. Those were those were great priceless <laughs> so anyways i got my friend doing some stuff there and i think i'm gonna go give him my hand but anyways before we leave make sure that you all stay awesome be cool be kind stay nomadic outlaws and you know how to be a nomadic outlaw subscribe to nomadic bandman that's how you become a nomadic outlaw and if nobody has told you they loved you today let me be the first I love you guys. Love each and every one of you. Stay tuned for next Sunday. If things are looking up, I actually have another set of um, uh, words set up for next Sunday already. But we'll ask. We'll find out how many people pop in. And it's pretty hard to have a, a word game when you have, like, one person. <laughs> Two, we have a game. 
and the more the merrier. All right, Justin and Christina, you have a great weekend and a great week next week. And Sandy, Sandra, have a great uh, week. And uh, Ronnie, Mr. Ronnie Braun there, fix, get your diesel heater going correctly and uh, do whatever you got to do to fix it and make her work. All right, guys, we will catch you all on the next one. Stay tuned.